heck are you, Jake? I don't know you. I don't know anything about you. Get away from me. You're weird. Yo, 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 yo. What is up, my gladiator? Sam here, and we are playing Pokemon Brick Bronze. I tried the other Pokemon game, right? And everyone spammed me to hell with comments saying, Sam, you played the wrong Pokemon game. And I'm like, oh, whoops. So I'm trying out Pokemon Brick Bronze. Apparently this one is a hundred million times better. So let's start a new game. Let's get right into it. So here's the intro. This is looking nice. This looks, I mean, honestly, this looks way better than the other Pokemon game. Look at that. We, we've got like all these different locations that we can go to and explore. This is going to be a lot of fun. I've been noticing a lot of people wanting me to play this. I'm like, okay, I will give it a shot. And so far, it looks way better than the previous one. And this is gonna, uh, this is our house, apparently. So we're able to go inside. And then, then this is where our mom should be. We're going to wake up and be like, Mom, Mom, I got to go catch some Pokemons, Mom. And there we are laying there. But, oh, is that the map over there on the side? I'm going to oh, hit the snooze button. I want to sleep. I want to sleep 10 more minutes. <laughs> he throws it. Oh, wait. Today's the day I wake up and I capture some Pokemon. I can't believe today has finally come. Today I get my first Pokemon from the Pokemon Professor. I have always dreamed of setting out on my own adventure with Pokemon. By my side. There are so many Pokemon in this world. I hope to discover them all one day. Every Pokemon. Well, I'd better get going. Oh, I almost forgot. I need to fill out my trainer card. So there's my trainer card. Type your name in. Oh, I'm Sam. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let's do Sam Pi. It's my face. <laughs> Sam Pi. Sam Pi. Did I write that correctly? Yes. Okay, awesome. So this is our trainer card. I'm that much closer to officially becoming a Pokemon trainer. Or like a, okay, um, attention news trainers. Some of the notes are, blah, 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 blah. thanks for playing. I didn't read that. I'm too lazy. I want to get right into it. So we're able to play. Oh, cool. This is interesting. This is a lot like the actual Pokemon game. So here is the entirety of the place that we can explore. And look, if you look to the right, Jerry and Chan have both joined me. So we should see them as we go through our adventures. They will be in the Pokemon world as well, capturing Pokemon with us. Ooh, look at that. Look at the sweet Pokemon. We got a really nice house. This, I gotta admit, this is way better than the one I played. Hey, Sampai, it's me, Jake. How's it going, Jake? Oh, I can't believe we're getting our first Pokemon today. This is a day we've dreamed of since we were kids. Who the heck are you, Jake? I don't know you. I don't know anything about you. Get away from me. You're weird. I'm on my way to the lab to get mine right now. You're not my friend. Oh, yeah. Your parents wanted to see you before you went to the lab. I saw them pass my house earlier. I'm heading towards the digging site. Hurry and go talk to them. I'll be waiting for you at the lab. Who is this strange guy who thinks he's my friend? My only friend is Jerry, who's right there. Jerry and Chan, how's it going, guys? How's it going? You've been waiting for me? You shall not pass. I'm not, I'm not allowed. What does that mean? I'm not allowed to pass? You guys? Yes. No, no. Well, what am I supposed to do if I'm not allowed to pass, guys? I need to go capture some Pokemon and imprison them. Stay. You want me to stay in my house? Do not go on the grass. Why are you guys being so controlling? I need to be free. I need to spread my wings and be a... F I'm a butterfly. Okay, Jerry, you got to let me soar. I got big, big butterfly wings. I'm going to soar. Okay, Jerry, you can't hold me back any longer. I am a dragon. Okay. Are you, you're, you're a dragon? I guess a dragon would be better than a butterfly. I think you'd be a lot stronger. Yes. But dude, we need to get to the Pokemon Center. I am a serpent. I'm I'm passing you guys. I passed you. I passed you. Let's, let's, let's go together. Come on. Come on, guys. Let's go capture some Pokemon and imprison them and make them our slaves so that they can do our bidding and do everything that I command them to do. Um, we need to go to the dig site, apparently, right? That's where we need to go, is to the dig site. So we have to go talk to our parents, and some guy named Jake thinks he's our friend. So we should probably tell him that he's not our friend. Oh, here's our parents. Wow, this game is amazing. <laughs> well, that ought to take care of it. We have to keep this a secret for everyone's safety. You're right. It's too dangerous for anyone to go down there. I don't think we should tell anybody about this. I mean, I'm, I'm hearing you, Mom and Dad. I'm, I'm hearing you guys. Maybe we can tell that new professor. Maybe you're right. Hey, how's it going? Oh, Sampai. You startled me. 
Hey champ, how's it going mom and dad? Today is the day you get your first Pokemon. Yes, I cannot wait to imprison him and make him do my bidding. We are so happy for you, sweetie. Yes, yes, yes. Sorry we didn't meet you at home. You should be sorry. We just discovered something in the cave last night. As archaeologists, your mom and I are very thorough in our work. That's right. But enough talking. Let's head down to the professor's lab and let you pick your very first Pokemon. We'll see you there. Okay, so we're going to go to the professor's lab and pick out our Pokemon. Which Pokemon? Oh, wait, isn't there usually three starter Pokemon? So each of us could pick a different one. Chan, you can have one. Jerry can have the other. And I will have the third type. Which type do you guys want to be? It's usually water, water, fire, water, right? Water, fire, water. Wait, I said water twice. <laughs> water, leaf, fire, right? I think that's how it goes. I haven't played too much Pokemon. Are you guys with me? Come on. I want fire. Um, Jerry, which which type do you want? Of course, of course, Yandere wants fire. Space? Space isn't a Pokemon type, Jerry. You can't have you can't have space. As, but but what? Space isn't a Pokemon type, Jerry. That doesn't work. It doesn't work like that. Space, please. Okay, okay. You could have a space type. Um, let's see, is this the professor? I will ask the professor if there's a space type. Please, I'll get you a space type. Don't you worry, Jerry. I'll make sure that the professor gets you one. Let's go in here and let's check this out. Is this, do, do we go in? Wow, I just love how smooth this is. The music is spot on. The angles are great. They worked really hard on this game. I've written over 50 reports on Pokemon. Wow, good, good for you, dude. Kind of bragging a little bit. The one I'm working on now is on Mega Evolution. Much is still unknown about the Mega Evolution. I've even had a few conversations with Professor Sycamore from, from the Kalos region. Okay. Great dude. Tell me about something. You're just kind of bragging. Oh no, it's Jake. I never liked you, Jake. Hello, my name is Professor Cypress. And the new professor in Mittistown. I'll bet... You're Sampai. Your parents were just telling me about you. You must be very excited to be getting your first Pokemon today. There are a few things you must know about Pokemon first. Pokemon are, are our friends and we grow alongside them. They grow, in some cases, evolve and change form as we battle with them. Your Pokemon will grow to love you as you adventure with them. Oh, that's cool. I never knew that before. You didn't know? Jake, you're so stupid. How could you not know that everyone in the world knows that Pokemon evolve? And how, like, how old is this guy? Like, for, hold up, sorry, sorry, I'm breaking, I'm breaking the conversation we hear. How old is Jake? And he didn't know that Pokemon evolved. Has he been living under a rock this entire time? It blows my mind. Yes, there are still many things that we don't know about the Pokemon. Sampai, I want you to, uh, I want you now to pick a Pokemon that you would like to uh, accompany you on your adventure. Make a choice from these 18 different different breeds. Go ahead. We have 18. What? 18. Okay, okay, okay. There's there's still leaf, fire, water, right? They're all leaf, fire, water. So you guys have to pick one of the each styles. I choose leaf. Okay, so I'll be water. I like blue. I think blue works really, really well for me because I've always been, um, I've always liked blue, like uh, for my uh, Minecraft shirt, I'll have blue and white. Those are kind of my favorite color schemes. What would be a good choice? I kind of started with the first generation, so I might just do Squirtle. If I'm going to be honest, I really like Squirtle. This guy's pretty hilarious, but I might... I think I'm going to do Squirtle because this is, I used to play Pokemon back in the day when it was the first Pokemon. Okay, excellent choice, Sampai. Thank you so much. Your new Pokemon is so cute. Thank you, Mom. That Pokemon definitely has potential in battle. I hope your Pokemon becomes best friends like we are. Dude, we're not friends, Jake. We're not, I don't even know you. You just showed up at my house and you're like, we're best friends. I don't know you, Jake. My best friend is Jerry. All right, Sampai, many challenges await you. Let, let me give you one other gift that you will, that will help you along your way. It's a Pokedex. It's like an electronic cycle, cyclopedia that records the kinds of Pokemon you encounter and capture. It will also help me in my research with Pokemon. Also, if you'd like, you can come back at any time and purchase another Pokemon from my assistant, David. Now, what are you waiting for?
Go and explore the world of Pokemon. Yes, Sampai. Go ahead and have fun with your Pokemon. We need to stay behind and talk to the professor for a minute. We'll meet up with you later. Okay, thank you, Mom and Dad. I'm going to go hang out with my real friends. Jake, don't follow me anymore. You're, you're a weird, you're a weird guy. Hey, Sampai, wait up. What did I just say? I just said, don't, don't follow me, and he's following me. We have a Pokemon now. We do. Let's battle. Are you so I'm going to destroy you, Jake, you weirdo. Oh, no, my mask came off. Pokemon trainer Jake sent out. Okay, go Squirtle. Let's get this. Let's mess him up. I'm going to fight. I ain't, I'm a, I ain't a runner. I'm going to do, do water gun. The opposing Eevee used... Ooh, that's a... Uh, Squirtle uses water gun. Hmm. Water gun kind of did the exact same amount of damage. So I'm going to do... I'm going to do tackle. Just smack Eevee. Ooh, Eevee's doing... Squirtle used tackle. Ooh, it's not working too well. Let's let's try... Let's try this one. Come on. Something's got to work, dude. I can't lose to Jake. I can't lose to Jake. Is this... Did, did that do anything? Let's do tackle again. Tackle seems like the best one. Use tackle. Ooh, it's working, it's working. We might actually beat Jake. Tackle again. Tackle him. Take that Eevee. Just grab him and smash him and break his bones. Squirrel, use tackle. Ooh, that's what's up, Jake. That's what you get, man. You thought you could beat me? You ain't got nothing on me, you weird looking dude. Now stop following me, Jake. Amazing. <laughs> Senpai received 200 points. Here, let me heal your Pokemon. Thanks, Jake. I guess that was kind of nice of you. You're still weird, though. Sampai, that was an excellent battle. Thank you, Mom. Your father and I watched you while you were discussing things with the uh, professor. We are very proud of you in taking this step in becoming a Pokemon trainer. <laughs> in becoming a Pokemon. Like, like I'm going to actually, like, turn into a Pokemon. My dream is to become a Pokemon. <laughs> like a kid just, like, dressing up like Pokemon. We want you to know that we will be supporting you as you explore. I can't read those words. You need to be very careful as you are going to be out on your own. For the very first time, don't forget to floss. Sampai, we want to give you something to take with you as a gift. To celebrate this moment, mo momentous occasion. What is that? It's a brick. Bronze brick obtained. It's a bronze brick. Sampai, the bronze brick is in the back. I made it into a necklace just this morning. When you look at it, remember your family who loves you. A brick? Don't forget to keep it safe. We're headed back to the house. Why would you give me a brick? If you need anything, that's where you can find us. Why are you giving me a brick, Mom and Dad? I don't want a brick. Wow, that was really cool of your parents. Oh, by the way, I have something for you. Uh, there for catching wild Pokemon. Obtain five Pokeballs. Thanks, Jake. Sampai, put the Pokeballs in your bag. It works best if you uh, weaken the Pokemon before throwing the ball. Well, I need to gather a few things before I set off on my adventure. You should go start training your Pokemon on Route 1. Pass Route 1 is Kleshmau Town. That'll be a good place for us to meet up. All right, I'll see you later. Uh, I don't want to see. I mean, thanks for the stuff, Jake, but that doesn't mean we're friends. Just, just because you give me Pokeballs, it doesn't magically make us friends. Okay, Jerry and Yandere. There you guys are. Where's where's Yandere? Oh, hey, here, there's a fan. How's it going, dude? What's up, my man? Let's go to the next area. So what, what what do we need to do now? We got the Pokemon. I can't I can't remember what we're supposed to do because we've been gone for so long waiting for Yandere to get back. Where 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 do we go? Adventure! Jerry, I got your Jerry cats. So we got a whole crew of people following us now. Uh, go to our house. I think we have to go to our house. Let's let's head on over here. Ooh, ooh, here's where we go. Ooh, this is where we go so we're able to actually actually fight and find Pokemon. Bugs are the most interesting Pokemon. I don't think so. I totally disagree with that. Bug catcher Ralph. Get away from me, Ralph. Bug catcher Ralph. Okay, let's try against my Squirtle, you bug catcher Ralph. I'm going to fight. Dude, if I had a flame type, that would really, really, really be nice. But we don't. So we're going to use tackle. Because I think water would probably just, like, water the bug. To I don't know if that would do too much. Um... Ooh, he's, he's not doing too much damage to it. Just keep, I think tackle's like maybe one of the best moves that we can do right now. Come on, just, just keep tackling him. Tackle him over and over and over. Ooh, dude, you're doing so much damage. Look at that. Tackle, tackle, tackle. I think a third tackle will work. Third tackle. Yes. Taking him down, dude. Screw your Pokemon. You ain't got nothing on me, man. Look, I lost like no health. Um, in 
Whirl a pit, you will switch your Pokemon. I don't know if I want to switch. I don't have anyone else. I don't have anyone else to switch with. We'll just keep we'll just keep fighting. We'll just keep tackling. I should try Water Gun at least once and see how it fares against the bug type. But I don't I haven't played Pokemon literally in forever. So I don't know all the like counters and stuff like that. But water might do pretty good. Scroll use water gun. Wow, that did a lot of damage. That was very, very strong. We already at level seven, dude. See you later, Ralph. Okay, so maybe my bugs aren't the best Pokemon for battling. <laughs> Sampai has received 72 points, dude. Nice one. All right, let's wait for all of our friends. I'm going to keep going around in here and try to find more Pokemon to battle. Ooh, this guy. You want to fight me, man? You want to fight me? More, more people to battle. Camper Jack would like to battle you. Camper Jack. Ooh, okay. Let's see what type of Pokemon you got. Let's use our water attack. I feel like the water is going to be really, really strong against his type. Wow, that did a lot of damage. I think only two hits for water. Dude, these guys are like nothing against my Squirtle. My Squirtle is insane. Bam, two hits. You're out of there. What are you doing, dude? My Squirtle is max. Maybe I should catch more Pokemon. You should. 96 points, dude. That's pretty good. Ooh, that is that's like a rabbit. I like that Pokemon. It's like a dude, I should get a rabbit Pokemon. That would kind of make so much sense. Use water gun. Use water gun, Squirtle. Pew! Dude, two hits with this thing is insane. They keep trying to lower my defenses, but it ain't working. It ain't working. I'm just gonna one, two. The old one, two, and you're down for the count. It's a bunny Pokemon. I haven't seen a lot of these Pokemon. There's a lot of new ones that I don't know about. I need to edumacate myself on all the new Pokemon. Well, I know this one. That's a Pidgey. That's a, that's a pretty clear, that's an obvious, that's one of the retro Pokemon. Wow, that's a lot of damage. What I should use is just use Tackle because I don't want to waste all of my Water Gun uh, sh uh, attacks. There we go. Taking them down. Taking them down. 32 points. Not bad. Not bad at all. I need to train my Pokemon more. Yeah, you suck. Because my Squirtle is at the top. He's the top-notch Squirtle. Look at everyone just following us. Are you guys all here battling that uh, that bug lady? I got here as fast as I could. It's Jake. Something terrible's happened. Jake, leave me alone. I need you to come back to town with me. I don't have time to explain. Let's go. You just you just think you can just pull me out. Sampai, I'm so glad to see you are safe. I'm so sorry to be the one to tell you this. But your parents have been abducted from their home in the short time you've been gone. Not much is known yet, but it is suspected that they were taken by a group of people known as Team Eclipse. You see, Team Eclipse is an organization of people who have a unique perspective on people and Pokemon. They believe that people and Pokemon are not at harmony with one another, and they have interesting ideas for how to solve this problem. They're also dangerous and not to be uh, trifled with. They seem to be, they seem to do whatever it takes to accomplish their goals. I don't know what they want with your parents, but I suspect it has something to do with their skill as archaeologists. Your parents are familiar with Pokemon of Legend on Rora. Whatever Team Eclipse is after, I'm sure they will, uh, they are getting very close to it. Achieving it. Now tell me, Sampai, did your parents say anything about their work when you saw them this morning? I don't think. Oh, so your parents gave you that neck that necklace earlier. That's interesting. Anyways, it's not safe for you here now. For the time being, it's best for you to leave town, at least until we figure out what's happened here. Chesh Cheshama town is a good place to start. It's just past Route 1. Be careful, Sampai, and don't go looking for trouble. Oh my god, our parents were just taken? Are you serious? Dude, <laughs> Patty, my parents were taken. And you're sitting over here going, whoa, 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 whoa. Patty, this is very serious. Okay, so it seems Jerry lagged out. Everyone's been super laggy today. I don't know why. I think his internet's been really bad. But we need to continue onward. Oh, another bunny type. Oh, sick, dude. That would be a really cool Pokemon. I keep saying that. Wait a second. I could capture it. Let me use Tackle. And then I'm gonna see if I can capture this this bunny, dude. That would be oh I don't want I don't want to kill it, so I'm gonna keep using tackle because the bunny would be perfect for me. This would be like the perfect Pokemon. I don't want to kill it. Squirtle use tackle. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Now let's go into our bag, and let's capture this bad boy. 
Use the Pokeball. I want to capture the bunny. <gasps> bunny, I want to capture Bun Bunny Bell Bun 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 I don't even know how to say his name. I'm super dyslexic, guys. Everyone knows this. I can't pronounce half these freaking names. <gasps> You've gotten the bunny. You get the necklace. Give a uh, nickname to the bunny you, you cut. Yes, I want to call him Bunny Boy. That's what all of my fans call me. You guys always call me either Sampai or Bunny Boy. So I'm kind of following in line with what you guys are always calling me using the classic nicknames. I want to maybe catch a few more Pokemon while we're waiting for Jerry to possibly come back. Ooh, that's an interesting one. That's a Fletching. A Fletching. Um, I'm gonna, I'm just going to use my water gun. I'm just gonna blast you out of the sky. He's like a little, <laughs> he's, he's like a little, uh, pigeon or something. He's not gonna be able to do too much. I'm gonna tackle him. Dude, Squirtle's getting so strong, but I wanna, I wanna level up Bunny Boy. I gotta level him up. Hopefully he was a boy. I don't know. I didn't check the gender of Bunny Boy <laughs> when, when I, uh, played him. But let's go through here. Hopefully Jake does not distract us. Oh, we got to do another fight. Ooh, it's a Pidgey. Should we capture Pidgey? Pidgey could be a pretty good Pokemon. Only level two, though. I might want to capture Pidgey. Ah, uh, maybe not. I don't think Pidgey would be cool. I want to I try some newer Pokemon that I'm not used to yet. And I want to level up Bunny Boy. Because we only have a few Pokeballs. And I want to capture as many as we can. Level nine, dude. Squirrel's moving up in the world, dude. You're moving up in the world. Can we go through this now? We can. So this is the next area. Dude, I'm loving this so much. This game is amazing. The Pokemon on Route 1 are pretty weak. Pokemon on routes ahead will be stronger. Watch out and make sure your Pokemon are prepared. Ooh, so they're going to be pretty tough. We may need to like level up the Pokemon before we get to the next area. I'm going to try this next area. <laughs> but I'm a little scared that they're going to be too strong for us. Hey, oh, hey, how's it going, Chan? Hey, over here. How's it going? You look like a brand new trainer. I am. This must be your first time traveling alone. Well, I've got my friends with me. Uh, Jerry did leave me, but I do have Chan and Patty. I see. Your parents were abducted by Team Eclipse. They were. That's terrible. It is. I have some information about Team Eclipse that might be valuable. Follow me to my home where you can discuss it privately. Some random girl comes up and says, Hey, how's it going? You're some new stranger. You want to come over to my house? <laughs> like, is that how you just welcome people over to your house? It's coming to my house. So your parents were taken by Team Eclipse. Gosh, that must be awful. I bet you must miss them. Oh, so they give you that necklace before they were taken? Do you mind if I see it? Thanks. The necklace looks old and valuable. Hmm, thanks. Did you just take my necklace? This girl just robbed me. I had a bad feeling about her. Jake, hey, there you are, Sampai. Who was that person that just took off running out of here? Wait, what? She took the necklace that was uh, that your parents gave you? That was the last thing your parents gave you before they disappeared. We have to go after her and get that back. I saw her running into the woods just outside of town. Quick, follow me and I'll lead you there. Oh my god. We literally just lost our necklace. I had a bad feeling. Like I said, like, this is probably a really bad idea. Why are we going? Is this a Starbucks? Dude, they have a Starbucks. <laughs> Wait, Sawbuck coffee. That is hilarious. Can we sit down? Chan, what are you doing? Are you like praising? You're like praising the sun. You're like, oh, no, no, no. Everyone's getting in the way. Okay, we need to get our necklace. She stole it from us. Let me get this. Uh, she's in here somewhere. Wait, right here so she doesn't get away. Go, you go look for her and get your necklace back. Okay, I may want to uh, heal up my Pokemon. I see like a little Pokemon center here. I may need to heal them before I go into the woods because that the lady said it's actually way more dangerous in here. Can you heal my Pokemon lady? Hello, welcome to the Pokemon Center. Would you like your, yes, I would like to restore them. Okay, just heal him up for me. I only got the two. I got Bunny Boy and Squirtle. I should also rename Squirtle. Thank you for waiting. Yeah, thank you. Uh, you've restored your Pokemon to full health. We hope to see you again. Thank you so much. Yonder, you should maybe restore your Pokemon to full health. That may help. That may be, that may be important. Um, let's go and begin our journey. We got to find the lady who stole our necklace. Metapod. That's kind of lame. I'm not feeling the Metapod. You guys should leave some comments down below which Pokemon you want me to capture because I need to find some really good ones. I want a really strong team. I don't want to waste my Pokemon on just anything. Should we switch Pokemon? I may want to switch and use Bunny Boy. Switch. 
because Bunny Boy needs to get some experience. Go Bunny Boy, I need to level you up. I need you to do some attacks for me. You got an agility attack, you got tackle. What is this agility, that's psychic normal? Let's just use this. I wanna see all of your abilities, Bunny Boy. You got anything good for me? Bunny Boy, use lure. It's just lowering your defenses. Now let's use tackle. Oh my God, this is literally gonna take forever to, to use tackle, but we gotta level up Bunny Boy. I want him to be fairly strong because it's a bunny. It makes sense, doesn't it? So we'll just sit here and use tackle. Be because I'm taking forever for, for, for be okay. because I'm taking forever everyone in the comments is like what is he doing is he fighting a legendary it's taking him forever they're just like waiting for me because they know I'm in like the, the fighting mode but because I'm trying to level up bunny boy it's taking an abnormal amount of time because <laughs> and now everyone's just waiting like what happened to him did he lag out no I'm still here bunny boy just needs to level up dude we got him 61 experience that leveled us up to level five, pretty good. Bunny boy is moving up in the world. Well darn, looks like you caught me. <laughs> oh, it's my fault for running into this dead end. The bridge was under construction, so hiding here was my only option. So you want this necklace back, huh? Well, too bad. Team Eclipse doesn't return what they what they earn. That's right, kid. I'm a member of Team Eclipse. The only way I'd let you have your precious brick back is if you beat me in a Pokemon battle. But let's face it. You are just a fresh new trainer. There's no way you can beat me. Let's battle, dude. You are part of the people who took my family away from me and took my brick. My brick is actually more important than my family, so I'm going to take you down. I'm going to switch. You're bringing out my strongest Pokemon. You've upset me. And when you upset me, Squirtle comes out and he is relentless. He does not forgive and he does not forget. He's gonna use water gun attack. Look at that damage, dude. I'ma destroy you. I'ma take you out of here. Use water gun, Squirtle, take him down. Say goodbye to your little fox, your little wolf. Wasn't anything against my Squirtle, man. You don't have anything. Bunny Boy grew to level seven, nice, cause he's in the first place spot, he's gonna be leveling up more. Um, no, 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 no. I have to go all out, I have to go all out, level nine. See, that's what I knew, I knew I had to go all out because Bunny Boy is not strong enough. He's too weak to fight this Pokemon trainer. So we're gonna go all out, we're gonna use our best attacks. Use Water Gun, come on dude. Use Water Gun, dude. Ooh, that was actually not very effective. Should we use Tackle? <gasps> dude, he's actually doing a lot of damage to me. Tackle, okay. It's critical hit. He's like a half health. He's lowering my defenses. Use tackle again. Tackle seems to be working way better. Ooh, he's weakened. He's weakened. Worst case scenario, Bunny Boy would be able to finish him off. But I think we still got this. Use tackle one more time. Maybe, maybe two more times. Oh my god, it's not working. <gasps> I got hit twice. Bunny Boy, it's up to you. It's all up to you. Level seven. Can you do it, Bunny Boy? I believe in you. You gotta use tackle. You don't have too many abilities left, but tackle. Ooh, it's not working too well. Oh my god. Oh my god, he just double hit me. Two hits. <gasps> I fainted. I literally lost. Sampai has no more Pokemon he can fight with. Oh my god, I lost. Oh no. I'll take your Pokemon for a few. <gasps> No, I lost him. I need to train better so I can get my Pokemon back and I can fight that lady who took my brick and stole my parents. I got a vendetta against her. Okay, so what I think we're going to do is we're going to end the episode here. And next episode, we're going to beat that lady. We're going to get our bronze brick back and we're going to get our parents. One question, why is a bronze brick so important to me? I don't know why my parents gave me that. But that's an interesting question. Maybe you guys can leave a comment down below and tell me what is up with that. And if you guys are enjoying this, hit it up with a like because this is so much fun. And I can't wait for Jerry and Yandere and, and Patty to level up with me. And I want to see the Pokemon that they've acquired along our adventure as well. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you guys want to see more, hit that like button. And don't forget to dingle my bell. <laughs> and I'll see you guys later. Peace.